Thank you for tuning in today to our Solo Sports channel on how to maintain your Wilson Biardo specifically. But if you're like us and you have this very expensive machine, you want it to run as best as possible for as long as possible. So we're going to walk you through how to clean it and keep it doing just that in this video right now. We're going to begin cleaning the machine now and the biggest thing to keep in mind is that you want the machine off. This way you can touch all surfaces of it without really activating any buttons or doing anything crazy. So the first step is to get rubbing alcohol, which we have here, and then a rag. You're going to want to put a small amount on the rag and this can clean all surfaces. You can do the top of the machine, the sides, the screen, the tool tray in here. You can do the arms, the rails, the surface, everything. You can even do the lock. Then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to lift the clamp off the piston and you're going to want to clean that piston. That goes back. Second one, same procedure. Getting all of that debris, making sure that when this is clean these are going to slide around perfectly get all the components. The second thing we're going to do is we're going to take a toothbrush, put a little bit of rubbing alcohol on there, and with that we can clean the teeth of the clamps. Same thing on this one. Then you're going to want to take it out and clean the inside. Again, we want to make sure that everything is running smooth, everything has good finesse to it, this can improve your racket time so that you're stringing quicker. It's going to take the wear and tear off the machine. Our final step is we're going to take some gun cleaner. We have a link for all these things in the description. You don't need much, just a little drop. Okay. And then as you can see here, I have a drop right there. I'm going to put my finger just behind it so that when I'm pushing this into the rails, I'm getting that exact spot. Again, it does not take much. I'm going inside the rail, the lubricant, the gun cleaner, only for inside these rails. Don't want to really use it anywhere else on the machine. And there you have it. We have clean clamps, clean rails, a clean machine. Everything is ready to be used. We like to do this every new stringer that uses the machine. So if I come in early in the morning and use this, I will clean it before I use it. If another stringer comes in later in the day or in the afternoon, they'll clean it before they use the machine. If you're the only one using your machine at home or in your shop, what you want to do is probably clean every five to ten rackets so that it's always singing, it's always playing its best, and that it's going to last the life of that investment. If you have any questions, be sure to comment below. If you like this video, please subscribe. And uh, thank you guys for watching.